Yeah, so we had our best finish um, in, C in the NCAA Division One era, uh, 22 and 8. Uh, we also finished in the top 100 RPI, um, which is a huge feat. Um, something that us coaches were especially excited about. We made a huge leap in that. Um, it showed how tough our preseason schedule was last year. Um, and then we made it to the championship match of the OVC. So the team is obviously very hungry, you know, coming off of that season. So this year we're concentrating a lot on, you know, setting new standards that if we want the same results, then we have to push ourselves every day to push outside of our comfort zone, whether that's on the court or leadership, what we're doing with hydration. And you know, we talk a lot about self-care. So really um, each player has taken a lot of ownership in what they're doing off the court for their, uh, in order Order to get a better performance on the court. Um, leadership across the board has been phenomenal. Every player in individual meetings, like, what can I do to make the team better? What about when we're struggling? What can I do? Um, that is huge. We have such a large team, and we have really a really large freshman class, a large sophomore class, and seniors. So to bridge the gap between everybody has been uh, really, really incredible to see um, the relationships being formed across every class. So our two preseason picks uh, for OBC were Jackie Scott and Taylor Jones. Um, they both were also on OBC teams last year, and. Uh, they, they really are two of the hardest workers in our gym. Both of them are actually captains as well. So um, I expect them to keep growing by no means, like if they hit any kind of cap and they want to keep pushing themselves as leaders on the court. Um, they both bring a huge presence to our team. Um, but with that, you know, everybody is working really, really hard and they do a really good job of pulling out leadership qualities out of everybody else on the team. So it's going to be a really tough preseason. A lot of teams are pretty similar to us. Uh, we ha I haven't actually seen IPFW in a long time um, or Quinnipiac. Uh, we did face Toledo last year. Really tough battle. So that, you know, I'm really excited for that match as well. But I'm really just excited to see you know, what we do against another side of the net. You know, we don't run a ton of five ones in practice, so to see what we can do up against the 5-1 team will be really interesting. And I'm excited to build on what we're already doing and, and then continue, you know, to push where we see our strengths and weaknesses after the weekend.